One of the most frequent questions that I get in a lot of my videos is the tape to weight scales that I use on hogs. Um, basically, I've been wanting to find out how big my pigs were when I dropped them. And I noticed these guys were doing a girth measurement. And so I had to do a little research into there and I found out it's the University of Idaho that came out with the formula. And you gotta understand this method is true to about five to seven pounds. And when y'all asked me where I bought it, I didn't buy it, I basically made it. So what I've done is I went on Amazon and pur purchased about 20, <laughs> there's a rabbit over here. <laughs> Mr. Cree's getting after him. Um, I purchased 20 of these and used one of them as a demo unit. And watch this video real quick on how to measure these hogs and why I truly believe that it's fairly accurate. Here's the big nasty boar that I shot last night. I'm gonna guess offhand he's probably between 190 and 200 just because I've shot enough of these to know. I'm gonna show you guys the two methods and using my tape to weight scale here. The first thing you want to do, well, what I like to do at least, is pull this thing as far out as possible. Now, you have to understand these are Amazon purchased, so these are not the best. I, I made sure I got all the way up to 350 pounds on all of them, but some of them would not pull out all the way to 60. But what I like to do is go ahead and expand it as far as possible, get the heavy end and slide it underneath the bore. Probably rolling it would be best, but I've had this guy sitting overnight. But what you want to make sure from here is to run it under his armpits as tight as possible right there. Okay, and you have to run this tight also. You can't have any slack in the tape. I've seen a lot of guys go like this and they'll say, oh, my bore is 225 pounds. You can't do that. It has to be tight. And usually this method, you're gonna get within five to seven pounds. Oh man, I called it, look at that. It's right at 200, it's saying 207 pounds but I'm gonna call it 205 because it's usually five to seven pounds off. All right, and then the next method, I'm gonna go ahead and zoom out. What you wanna do here, if you wanna use the more scientific method, the way that uh, they do um, at, hog, or at pig sales, is you need to get these measurements. So the 205 measurement is 40.5. And what you're gonna do is multiply 40.5 times 40.5 by the length of the hog from the back of the head to the tail, and let me zoom out. So we've got 40.5, and then you need to measure from the back of the head right there to the tail, which is gonna put me right at, let's just call it 38. And then you're gonna round that, and then you're gonna use 300 as your consistent. So let me do the math on my phone, and you can see what I'm talking about. Step one is to multiply 40.5 times 40.5, Step two is to multiply this big number by 38, which is the length of the hog, and you will come up with this big number. And then step three is to multiply it by the standard of 300, which will give you this weight at exactly 207 pounds. And here you go. I've got exactly 20 of these things, including the one that I demoed. I have this one out as an example. I wanna show you real quickly. I tried as much as possible to write the number or the weight right on the line scale. But if you notice on this one, I knew that it was gonna to be too dark to see. Make sure you're using the actual 25 as the measuring scale as it goes up uh, throughout that chart. So I've got 20 of these. I'm gonna sell this one on discount because it has been used. There's no blood on it, but I'll sell that one for seven bucks. I'm gonna sell these for $10 a pop. I've got both Zelle and Venmo uh, that you can use. If you will comment what color you want below, and if you notice somebody else's claim that color, don't ask for it. But um, I'm gonna be mailing these out hopefully the week of Thanksgiving on that Tuesday. I'm heading to Bernie, Texas this week, so I won't be able to get it out in the mail. But comment below, $10. Email me at this information that I'm providing right here, and I will get you all the information how to get the money to me, and then I will drop this in the mail next Tuesday, and you guys can start measuring yo hogs. Stay tuned for my Bernie, Bernie, Barney adventure. <laughs> I also want to apologize if there's golden retriever hair in your package. I can't control his summer shedding right now. Ah!